I'm recording now. Me too. Welcome back, everyone, to episode 13 of our Red and Blue versus Challenge. Anton, are you ready? Mm-hmm. Three, two, one, go. Alright, so this entire episode, I assume I'm just going to be lost in the fucking caves of wonder. Or whatever. Yeah, I think it'll probably be more than just this episode. I think, I think it'll be several. God. Damn it. Man, if only if only had like a third monitor to like look at like a map or something. Well, something's already trying to fight me. Oh, it's a ditto. Wait, what are these caves uh, called? I wanna say it's the dark I cave, but I, I really don't think it is. My basic question is, I haven't been in these caves. Am I allowed to catch oh, yeah. the ditto? I don't know why wow, you... Cool. Well, I guess if it's your first thing, you gotta, but that sucks. That's not yeah. a good... But anyway, I'm, I'm trying to justify getting a third monitor. Because that's expensive. Oh, ditto use transformed. You turn to a right. But I really want a third monitor. I should have cheaped out and got cheap, shitty monitors, but I didn't. Yeah. I have a monitor without a power source. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> How did you lose the power source? Um, I don't know. I have two very nice monitors. Yeah, I cheap out on... Pretty much everything. Yeah, my computer was like the one thing I didn't want to cheap out on because having a cheap computer only makes you sad. That's fair. I can agree with that. And so, like, each of my monitors are 24 inches. Holy which is shit. awesome. And they're 1440p. Jesus. Yeah. Like I said, I don't fuck around. Because I knew, like, my graphics card. <laughs> Wasn't gonna do the 4K at that size, probably. Hooray! I caught the ditto. No, I, I'm battling a ditto. Oh, cool. Capable of copying an enemy's genetic code to instantly transform itself into a duplicate of the enemy. I think we already knew that. Ditto? Do I want to name Ditto? Yeah, my shit's healed. Yes, I do. What are you gonna name him? Otid? Spice oh. Girl. Which Spice Girl? <coughs> you should name it like something spice. Just... Like Sad Spice or Happy Spice or something. No, Scary well, Spice. Well, that's already a Spice Girl. It has to be like the sixth Spice Girl. Or seventh or however many yeah, there are. There's... Ah, but I want to name it Ditto because like, that's such like a, that's like a 90s term. <laughs> spell it different. Call it so Ditto, but gonna... spell it different. Like D-I-D-O. D-I-D-D-O. I think D. Okay. I think I like do that. Just, just only two D's would be like Dio. I think that's a singer. D I D D O. I'm gonna call him Ditto Spice. <laughs> Ditto Spice, that's if it fits. Do. <laughs> Does it need a hyphen? No. Fuck no. Oh, shit. No. Okay. I'm gonna do D I D O hyphen Spice. I just got a motherfucking Master Ball. Oh shit, son! How'd I just you get found that? it. Where do you find to keep buying these I didn't things? Buy it, I found it. Like I just found it out in the wild. Okay, I'm gonna go back into the caves and I'm gonna figure out where the hell I am. Rock tunnel. Okay. Got a ditto. On rock tunnel. Alright. I don't know how you live with one monitor. I couldn't do it. Um. Oh, cool! A pincer. I'm gonna run away. <laughs> it must be super strong. <laughs> oh, a Kingler. No, he's all he. He's a level. He's gonna too. crush me with all that horsepower. Oh yeah. <laughs> that was a callback mm-hmm. to the previous episode. So if you haven't watched that one, go back right. and watch it now. 
Oh yeah, are we are we putting links up? I feel like we're do, totally doing that. I right? haven't been, but I could. Yeah. There's been not a whole lot to link to. That's fair. Get wrecked, pincer. I'll just link everybody to your Facebook page. Oh, for <laughs> sure. You'll have six new friends by the end of the year. Oh my god, some guy's trying to fight me? How can he even see me? Elite Four wants to fight. I feel like that's it's not, not... That's not right. That's, that's not right. <laughs> it might be, but it's probably not. But maybe. I don't need to know... I don't need to know a lot to know that oh, uh, that's not right. Alright, Larry. Now is not the time to fuck around, alright? Let's kill this after this right Jinkless now. is gonna it. die. Kill it now. Shit. Oh, fuck me. Come on, Larry. Larry, please. Larry, please. Fuck yeah, Larry, I love you. Larry came through. Hell yeah, Larry. Hell yeah, Larry! I just found another fucking nugget. This has been good. This is a good-ass episode. I'm gonna go get another item, because it's gonna be fucking baller. I can feel it. Got a master ball and a nugget. And what's this next shit gonna be? Probably another master ball. It can only be good. That's what I'm thinking. I think I'm gonna get out of the caves. No, you're not. I refuse to believe that. I'm pretty good. Pretty good at finding things, so. Shit. Fire spin's gonna fuck me up. Well, it's gonna fuck Larry up. I'll be fine. Well, I pretty much just won the game because I defeated the other <laughs> four, so. Well, just one of them. Fun fact. Just one of them. Jinx. God damn it, I wish I had a fire type. A tentacool. More like a tentacruel. Ten tentacool evolves into tentacruel. I know. Did you? Are you I sure? Did. I mean I figured as much. Cause I kinda figured you didn't know that. <laughs> and you're just Spitballing and happened to. No, I could look at Tentacruel and see that it's bigger than Tentacool and figure <laughs> out the name. All right, like I'll admit I am an idiot, but I'm not that dumb. Escape rope. Okay, that's underwhelming, but not bad. A mule. Oh gosh, darn it! I'm not even gonna ask to catch this mule because I don't fucking want it. I'm gonna run. You're not going to no. catch the Mew? It's not a new encounter. Oh, wait. Oh. But remember, you caught your Mew because I was generous. I do remember that. But I don't want no punk-ass weak you, Mew. I got Vile Plume. Oh my god. Every three fucking steps. There's everything in this tower. Holy shit. So I'm fighting the second um, Elite Four, I guess. Oh my god, every three Liquid god bad. fucking steps! Holy shit! The god fucking steps. Alright, I'm gonna heal before I fight this Marowak. Oh yeah, I'm at the, uh, the Lady Marowak now. <clears throat> Alright, here we fucking, I think... Okay, yeah, it is. It is, uh... Need a Reno. I don't think I can catch it. So. I'm just gonna fucking kill it. Oh, hell yeah. Larry doing work. Uh. 
Looks like there's some beer tasting thing on Friday that I am. This Friday? Yeah, so I guess I'm going to have to do that. Yeah, this Friday I'm actually in the Milwaukee for a little bit. Do you want to go to a beer tasting Not event? That I'm, uh, that I'm driving <laughs> up or down or east or west to get to Milwaukee. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I think they figured out where but you live. I, I am driving within a six hour radius <laughs> of Milwaukee to get there. Um, because someone that I know might may or may not allegedly have a graduation <laughs> in the greater Milwaukee area. <laughs> so which is it? Actually, at this point, does it really it really doesn't matter. Well, no, I guess it matters, but it doesn't matter because like nothing's real time. Right. By the time this episode airs, you'll be long gone. Mm. As in dead. Yeah, hopefully. At least for me. I'll be passed out and dead from the uh, the bleach asphyxiation. That was Where's another that? callback to a previous episode, so go back and watch that one too. Mm. I don't like these tunnels. Do you feel like you're navigating through it well? No. I mean, I feel like I'm just walking and things are fucking up my day, and that's what we're doing. That sounds about right. Oh, no, I had things I have to do on Friday. Gosh darn it. What, like work? No, I don't have to work on Friday. I took this Friday off. Yeah, I know. We said you have things you have to do. Yeah. I have other things I need to attend to. Like, I need to buy, um, because my funeral is the next day. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm having my funeral. Oh, okay. Because, well. Yeah, walk off, bitch. Uh,. But yeah, I I have things I need to prepare for for Saturday. And I think like your funeral. Funeral. And I think oh, okay. I'm having people come over on Friday night. Well, that sucks. I guess it's fine, but like that sucked. Uh, not really. I mean, it's at the beer tasting is at a fitness center. So how good could it be, really? Probably not that good. Yeah, it's. 20 bucks which is kind of a lot I suppose I should see uh, confirm the plans I suppose before I commit although I am fairly confident shit I do like beer tasting though yeah, drinking beer is kind of like uh, might be my favorite thing. Well, have you been to like a beer tasting event? Uh, no, actually, I haven't been to a beer tasting event. I've tasted a lot of beers, but it's a little different at a beer tasting because it's like, I guess I don't know how big this one will be, but it's not like they pour you like a twelve ounce glass and you drink the whole thing and then you move on to the next one. It's like, no, is it like a flight? It's like uh, maybe like two shots. What's a f no, you, no, like a flight is like you get like a board and it has like 12 on it. This this is like yeah. it'll have like um all of the breweries like it's not not like Miller breweries or Budweiser or whatever it'd be like the little craft breweries from wherever they'll set up like a booth and then they'll give you like it's probably like maybe like three shots size kind of glass and you walk up and they'll have all their beers out on display. And you're like, oh, I'll have, we'll just say it's Ballast Point. And you'll say, okay, I'll have the the Grapefruit Sculpin. And they'll pour you, like, two shots worth of beer. And then you taste it. And then... I mean, but it's essentially like a flight glass kind of thing. Yeah, but they don't fill it up the way they do at, like, a flight at, like, a brewery kind of restaurant place. So okay. it's more like just for the taste it. And... Like, one sip is to, like, taste it, and then the second sip is, like, to finish it if you like it. Otherwise, you dump it out because, oh. yeah, 
And so, like, that that's one thing that, like, takes a little bit of getting used to. Because, like, you're going to drink 50 or 60 beers, maybe, or you could. So if you're drinking, like, yeah. that much, you're going to be fucking wasted at the end. So Yeah, that's the plan. Yeah, kind of. But also you're there to find out what you like. There, there has to be some kind of reason that you're there, other than just getting hammered. So that when you see the good stuff in the store, okay. you can find it. So you can't be afraid to dump it out, because cause that was the hardest thing for me, going to the beer tasting things. I've been to a few. Because I, I, I went to one a couple months ago. I was with a guy who had never been to one. He's like, what are the buckets for? I'm like, it's for dumping out the beer that you don't like. He's like, I like every beer. See, that? I don't, I don't, I don't get that. that. That part would hurt. Yeah, you say that now and then have 40 different beers in one night. You're like, okay, yeah, I don't really want to drink any more of this one because I've had 12 ones that are better and this one sucks. So, so that was the same thing. That's what he said. I'm like, I like every beer. And I'm like, okay, I'll see you at the end of the night. We'll see what you think of that. So, yeah, it was after, like, ten of them. He's like, I really don't want to drink this whole thing. I'm like, that's what the bucket's for. So, going into it, you, you think you don't need to dump, but but you do, really. Just because there's no reason to drink that much bad beer. Because it's not all good. A lot of it is fine. And then as the night goes on, you get drunker, you start to tolerate less. That's also one of the issues. I think uh, now I got the poke flute, and you're still stuck in the cave. So, uh, mm-hmm. but also there was that beer tasting thing down in the city that we live near. That I'm not going to mention, even though you keep talking about it. That mm-hmm. we were talking about going to. Well, I mean, I, I think we live near is a very general <laughs> statement. <laughs> I mean, I don't, I don't that you live within a six year. mile radius of, or a six six hour radius of a six yeah. hour radius. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm within a six hour radius of yeah Milwaukee, <laughs> fucking Minneapolis, Ooh. Chicago, Indianapolis. You're not getting yeah. to Indianapolis in six hours. I could get to Indianapolis. Yeah, in if six there was hours. no other traffic and no cops and no speed limits. Yeah, I suppose you could kind of get anywhere in six hours with those kind of rules. I can get to Columbus in ten. Ah, I shouldn't say that. I can get I can get to Columbus in eleven and a half. Why is that the landmark that you know? Uh, I went there for a concert once. For what was it like a day to remember or something? Actually, yes, I, I was. remember that. So that that yeah, wasn't just a shot in the dark. I kind of remember you doing that. No, yeah, they were like, hey, Anton, do you want to go see A Day to Remember? And I was like, oh, sure. <laughs> and they forgot to mention it was in Columbus until you were halfway there. Like, hey, man, we've been, well, in the ro- we've been on the road for a while. What's the deal? <clears throat> well, like, my dad called me, and he was like, hey, we're because this was this is my freshman year, so Eric was still in college. And they're like, oh, we're visiting Eric for a soccer game. Where are you? And I was like, um... <laughs> Well, I'm past. I have to be past Elkhorn by now. <laughs> and he's like, "What?" And I'm like, "Elkhorn, Indiana." And he's like, "Where are you?" And I'm like, "On uh, en route to Columbus." And he's like, "What?" And I was like, "Yeah, I got some. I got some stuff uh, going on in Columbus. I guess." Ah, oh, God, this fucking Snorlax. Yeah, that's weird. I wouldn't, you know, I was a, it was a good concert. Like, it was really cool, but, like, I, I don't know. I, I wouldn't just, go to Columbus for it. Well, it's just, that, like, I don't, I didn't listen, and I don't listen to A Day to Remember. Yeah. Like, I, they're fine. Not, like, I wouldn't drive more than, like, an hour and a half to one of their concerts. And you drove, like, six or ten. You drove way farther for one of those concerts, and I think I like them more than you do. I mean, I to be fair, I didn't drive at all. I just sat in the car and made. But jokes. even that, that's that's more than I would have done. <sighs> God, this these caves fucking suck. 
Yeah, I'm kind of I'm kind of wondering how long it'll take you to get through there, and how many times you're going to walk out the wrong thing and have to start over. Just like circle around back to where you are. Excuse me. Man, Larry is just... What level is your uh, Mew? 38, maybe? Oh, Larry just got to 39, so... Uh, I'm going to die. <laughs> You're waiting to die? I, mean, I don't know. This guy... An Aerodactyl, of fucking course. I don't know why I went this way. <sighs> this is not... This is not the way to go. This was a stupid way to go. I should fly out of here. Oh, no, I'm at the Snorlax. Alright. Um, Ten minutes to go. So... Mm -hmm. I'm going to wake the Snorlax up. With your flute? flute. <whistles> what a beautiful song. Strong Legs woke up. It attacked in a grumpy rage. Alright, let's see what it is. It's Need Arena, which is disappointing because I already have one. Man, I hope that the other... I hope the other one isn't also a need arena. That'd be sad. I will admit, when you said hypnosis was like really good, you are so fucking right. Oh, you've been using it? Oh my god, I've just been destroying with hypnosis. Yeah, it's a pain in the dick though if you're fighting against somebody who has hypnosis. God damn. I hate it. I hate it so much. It's like oh it's like God. worse than rap. <laughs> I just went through a ladder and all it did was put me in a different room. Yeah, that's how ladders work. And I'm fighting a fucking Neo. Alright, I'm gonna go fight the other the other Snorlax and I'm gonna see if I can get to that gym before the time runs out. <sighs> Oh my god. The Mew turned into me and put me to sleep. <laughs> what a fucking bastard. I know. I was gonna... Oh, and he's using Lick. Shit, that's what I was gonna do. I, I did use that. He's confused. Oh, fuck me. He's using all the things I want to use. Alright, well, Ooh, fuck. Ooh, it's an Edo King. Mew. I might have to get my own Ike Turner. I think that'd be fun if I had my own T9 Ike. Although you do have your, are you, you you're not using Ike, are you? Uh, no, I haven't been to a computer yet. Yeah, I probably wouldn't use him either. Having one is enough. I don't need both. Hey, so I have a ghost. I'm fighting, uh, uh, I'm fighting a Gengar. Okay, so use Lick. Well, I, I subbed out Mew. You subbed out Mew? Or I subbed in Mew. Because Gengar was getting fucked by the other Gengar. Like, all of these are normal moves that I feel like don't affect Mew. Or don't affect Gengar. Oh yeah, like Mega Punch wouldn't hit the Gengar. Yeah. Yeah, so you'd have to use... uh like metronome and hope that it's something that doesn't suck. That's what I'm doing right Are now. Are you really? <laughs> yeah. <sighs> you can't use your... Oh, you don't have any, like, potions or something to heal your Gengar? I mean, I probably do. I just don't want to waste them. Oh, well, that's what I would do. <laughs> Alright, five minutes. 
Man, I really hope I can get to the gym leader in five minutes. That way you can sit there and listen to me fight the gym leader. It's strategery. So I did ground attacks, hurt, fuck. Oh, bottom club axe actually works, all right. Yeah, the only thing that ground wouldn't so hit no is a flying type. Because Pokemon don't have abilities it's yet in this generation. It's just confusing, because like... Haha, <laughs> what a perv. Come on. Hey, Wackamero, wake the fuck up. I don't need a train. Jesus Christ. Shit! Wake up. Thank God. Right. Let's make this shit quick. I don't know where the fuck oh, I, I didn't am. Heal. Damn it. That was stupid. <laughs> it's dark. Is that what are you complaining? Oh my god, a Pokemon fucking... Oh god damn it. <sighs> Fuck me. I'm gonna die. I have no Pokemon left. This guy is gonna defeat me with a goddamn Butterfree. Cause Ragneg is still fucking asleep. And now he's confused. Motherfucker. What an asshole. Kick his ass. Come on, come on, come on. Please. Use hypnosis. And it does nothing. And I'm asleep again. Yeah, just like, you know what? Why don't you just fuck me while I'm asleep? Because that would be better. Because <laughs> you wouldn't know what's happening? Is that what you're getting at? Yeah, I don't know. Shit. I don't know. Oh, okay, this is fine. Except Thundershock is so goddamn weak. Oh, that's annoying. I don't know that Pikachu doesn't actually learn uh, Thunderbolt in this game. Which sucks ass. He's using this weak shit Thundershock all the time. Until he learns Thunder, which will mess I'm all the time. Die. This is it. Uh, great. whack -a dead. Which leaves... So that doesn't do anything. Karate Chop does actually nothing as well. Sleep Powder, and I'm asleep. Okay. Yeah, please go ahead. Just take advantage <laughs> of me. And I'm dead. Oh, really? Wrong. So you gotta you gotta start the cave over then. That's what that sounds like. No, no, I have I still have Smug Fuck, but it's a flying type, so I don't think Mega Punch is gonna do anything. It missed. Great. All right. Well, I got to the gym leader. I use Mega. Okay, so Mega Punch defeated Butterfree. And he's about to use Parasect. No, I won't change Pokemon, because I don't have any other fucking Pokemon. It's a good thing that Smug Fuck is a 37 and a fucking legendary. I'm just gonna run away. I'm just gonna run away. Cause a dragon, a, a wild dragon had appeared, and I just don't. Oh hell yeah! And a Firo. Is Kevin still alive? Yeah, Kevin's still alive. All right, Kevin, please just come in and fuck this Firo up, so you can all just go home. Oh damn it, Kevin! You had one job. And you did it very well. Good job, Kevin. Good job, fucking Kevin! Hell yeah! That gym was easy as shit. We still got time left. I can maybe make it out of this gym. Got TM21. Alright, let's just see what that is. I, I, went, I just, just went, went up, up a different ladder. ladder. I, don't I don't know where the five, fuck I am. Five, four, three, two, one... <clears throat>
in time. Uh. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. This is episode 13 of the Red Blue versus Challenge. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and ring that bell. This sucks. Anton, is there anything else you want to add? I hate the fucking caves. Whatever caves I'm in. <laughs> what is this? Hold on. The, the rock, rock tunnel. That's tunnel. what it is, yeah. The rock tunnel is full of chokes. It's good for you. I'm so angry. <laughs> we'll see you all next time.